Now to a developing story out of Stratford. Four people are dead after a wrong way crash on the Merritt Parkway. Happened early this morning near exit 52, shutting down the highway for hours. NBC Connecticut's Amanda Pitts joins us live from Stratford now with some new details. Amanda. Yeah, Mike, sadly, everyone involved in this crash was killed instantly. We don't yet know the identity of that wrong way driver, but we do know the minivan that was hit head on here on Route 15 this morning had three people inside, a man and woman in their 80s and a man in his 50s. Police right now trying to piece together how this happened. Tragedy on the Merritt Parkway. Two vehicles crashing head on on the southbound side of Route 15 around 1.45 this morning near exit 52. The wrong way driver in a Honda SUV and three people inside a Chrysler minivan all killed instantly. There used to be a safe road, but it's not, not no, turning into another 95. State police now confirming the identities of those in the minivan. 55 year old Stephen Rowland was driving. His passengers, 80 year old Thomas Vitali and 81 year old Olga Vitali, all from Easton. The wrong way driver hasn't been identified due to the extent of their injuries. Their Honda was engulfed in flames. It's another wrong way crash happening on one of our highways. Uh, these are you know, deadly, they're dangerous, they're happening way too frequently. This crash marks the fourth wrong way crash so far this year, resulting in a total of 11 deaths. It's unclear where this wrong way driver got onto Route 15, but troopers say they received multiple 911 calls of them driving north in the southbound lanes. It's got to change because we're getting too many people killed on the parkway. 95 and Route 8. Bob Leedy lost his niece in a crash on the parkway. Today's news brought him back to that day. I wouldn't want to see that happen to anyone, but it's happening in this day and age. Now, a trooper responding to this crash this morning actually got into a crash on the other side of Route 15, hitting a car that had pulled over to help those victims. Luckily, that trooper has minor injuries. Coming up at 6, we'll tell you just how many wrong way crashes have happened in this area of Route 15 in the last few years. Live in Stratford, Amanda Pitts, NBC Connecticut News. Mike.